What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my world, and I'm about to take probably the worst challenge any Gran Turismo Sport player can take. I'm about to take the most extreme car in the game, the SRT Tomahawk X, and I'm about to run it in a... It's only a one lap, but I'm about to run it on the Nürburgring, Norch Life, and GP Circuit combined into one circuit. Oof. I honestly decided, you know what? I might as well just try it. I've never done anything like this before, even though I've played Gran Turismo so long. But I think I'm about to go through the worst race ever. So, here we go. We're about to get started on that. Alright, you guys. Here we go. I'm already on the the menu to select your track. Here's a, We're taking the 24-hour circuit, which is, again, the GP and North Life combined. Gonna take, I don't know, maybe, maybe let's just go on noon. I mean, I'll do a night race if you want me to, but you're gonna have to ask for that. And here is the beast, the SRT Tomahawk X. It looks good, but it's far too fast to car. I've already driven it a couple of times. It is nuts. So we're gonna make one lap. Yeah, rolling start. Starting grid, maybe we should go all the way to the back of the grid. Just cause, you know, boost strong, mechanical damage. Let's make it heavy. <laughs> By then, I don't even know if I'll make it. One tire wear, one fuel consumption, and the grip. Let's make it real. Let's make it real, folks. We're gonna make the opponent difficulty professional, as I'm pretty darn good at GT Sport. But then again, I don't know if that if that's gonna get me through this race. And penalty settings. Nah, I can't right now, man. I'm, I'm uh, uh. That's too, that's too extreme a race already. All right, you guys, here we go. I got my steering wheel all set to go with a little decoration in the middle from my friend. And we got all things set. There's uh, the opening race, uh, not the opening race, the uh, menu before the race. And here we go then. Okay, you guys, here we go. This is it. I've never done anything like this before, so if I start crashing, then yeah, don't blame me for it. Okay, don't blame me for anything. Got it? Good. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. All right, here we are, the Norse life. What a great way to say hello to me, right? I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. Well, it seems I finally got it back into shape. Okay. Man, now I'm a minute and a half behind the next position. Oh no. Oof. miles per hour this thing is just wiggling around I'm trying so hard to keep it stable but it just doesn't want to what if I oh no I need to start breaking no 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 okay well okay who else saw that I'm pretty sure everybody did because I just went over a cone and this thing just wanna take off like a rocket yay we made it you guys we're back on this main stretch yay after probably the worst race in the history of GT Sport, or at least for me that is. And guess where you find yours truly? Down at the bottom, position number 20. Three minutes, 53 seconds behind the leader. Oh, that sucked. Well guys, there you have it. That was the worst race for me ever in GT Sport. But I'm glad I actually got through it. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.